14 years after selling Ranbaxy to Japan's Daiichi Sankyo for whopping 4.6 billion dollars, the two grandsons of the pharma major's iconic founder Bhai Mohan Singh have been sentenced to 6 months in prison by the Supreme Court. The Apex Court today ordered the jail term for Malvinder Singh and Shivinder Singh in the Daiichi Fortis case as well as fine of 5000 rupees. The brothers are already in Delhi's Tihar jail since October 2019 in connection with the case of alleged illegal diversion of funds and money laundering. The brothers also figure in a sensational case investigated by Delhi police against conman Sukesh Chandrasekhar for allegedly cheating the family of over 2000 crore rupees. The Singh brothers were dragged to Supreme Court after the Japanese drug maker challenged the Fortis IHH deal to recover the 3600 crore rupees arbitration award it had won at a Singapore tribunal against them. The brothers had sold their pharma company Ranbaxy to Dait Sankyo in 2008 for 9576 crore rupees. However, soon after Dait discovered they had hidden information about the company being under US FDA scrutiny. The next few years saw the Japanese major apologize to a court in US, pay 500 million dollars in fines, be penalized by the EU on various counts and fight numerous legal battles. Ranbaxy was finally sold to Sun Pharma in 2014 for around 4 billion dollars. Meanwhile, the two Singh brothers were living life king size from the proceeds of Ranbaxy. According to information available with Business Today, 2000 crore rupees was spent on taxes and repaying loans. 1750 crore rupees went into Religare and 2230 crore into Fortis Healthcare. 2700 crore rupees was reportedly given to their maternal uncle Gurjinder Singh Dhillon, who was also the head of Radha Swami Satsang Bias. The Supreme Court order today on Fortis involves its subsequent sale to Malaysia based IHH Healthcare in 2018. IHH bought 31% stake in Fortis for 1.1 billion dollars and announced an open offer for an additional 26% stake. The open offer was however opposed by Daiichi which had won a 3600 crore rupees arbitration order against Fortis followed by a contempt plea against the Singh brothers in 2019 the supreme court also remanded the issue of fortis ihh deal to the delhi high court which will decide on whether the open offer for fortis can be allowed based on the evidence it gets fortis meanwhile has said that proceedings before the supreme court have concluded with certain directions and the suo moto contempt has been disposed of and that it was seeking legal advice to decide its future course of action bureau report business today television if you like the video do like comment share and subscribe